Hey guys, it's Tom like man it's 20 and this video I'll be showing you how to make your joy appear when you touch a brick or a part. So this could never touch a part in Roblox Studio. A joy will appear. Anyways, let's get into this video. Okay, once the first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna go up here on our home tab and set this little part thing beside our toolbox. Then if you click on that, you'll see this little part that appears on your base plate. And then we can go ahead and customize it. So I probably make it a bit bigger. Like that. Then I'm going to change the color of it made to like a nice red. And then I'm going to make the material of it to neon. Then we're going to make our little dry. So if we go into start dry, we can insert a screen dry. Then I can just name this like a dry and then there we can answer frame so right here's our frame which is going to appear also this video was partly a fan idea so thank you for the idea if you're watching this video we can make that blue oops that went with the board size pixels and then inside our frame we can enter a text button and this is going to be our close button this is just a basic dry, nothing much. We can make it like that. Then I could change the background color of it to red so you can tell that it's uh, like a close button. Then I can get rid of the border size pixels and I could go down to our text settings. Then I can make a nice cartoon font. You can name it to X. Then I can make the text color to white. We can make it like this. So now we have our clothes button. Also, I'm just going to name this close. So in case like you have more stuff on your dry, like you'll be able to tell which one that is the clothes button. And yeah. So now if we just get if we just make that no longer visible. So now we're done with our frame. We can get onto the scripting. So if we go into our frame, we can insert a local script. Then we can do game dot workspace dot part dot touch is connect function touched then I could go down and I could do if touched then uh, we can go down and do script dot parent dot parent dot frame dot visible equals to true so right here is, is our script up and then if we make the frame visible again we're going to do it for a little close button so we go into our here we can enter a local script then can do script dot parent dot most button one click is connect function and then we could go down and do script dot parent dot parent whoops dot parent dot visible equals to false and then once we're done that once again we can go down we can make the frame no longer visible and then we can press play to test this you see when i load in when i touch it the joy will appear and i can close it and yeah I think that's going to be it for this video. And if this video helped, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you all next time. Bye!